Welcome to The Witcher 3, my first ever playthrough. We had a great start to the game. Um, the intro has definitely drawn me in a bit. And now we're at a point where we are trying to find Yennefer. We apparently need to go fight a griffin so that we can get some more information on where she went. Because we're just kind of following her trail at this point. So let's see how this goes. It's been a great start. And we have to continue. Trail's fresh. Ms. Love just left home. Yeah, like, let's go get him. Where'd he go? There's supposed to be a guy here. He's like rustling around in the woods. The audio is great. Hello? You, Ms. Love. Shh. Hear that? Wolves? No. Wild dogs. Yes. More dangerous than wolves. Dogs more dangerous than wolves? Really? Don't think so. It's the truth. Know why? No, but I guess you're about to tell me. <laughs> wolves hunt to fill their bellies. Wild dogs kill for sport. Just like humans. Aye. They've learned much from us. Why not cruelty too? Okay, I suppose. I'm hunting bigger game. The Nilfgaardians the Griffin killed. Where'd you find them? Ah, I see. Why not love? You a witcher. That monster slayer they's talking about in the village. Mm. I'll show you, sure. But, uh, I gotta kill those mutts before they hurt someone. Will you help? That is, if you don't mind blunting your silver blades on them. Sure, combat sure. practice. Griffin's not going anywhere. No, dogs might though. So step careful now. Come on. These like, what if people die because I now. I'd help Since him? Since the war started, soldier on the not. march, he'll stop to rape a woman, strangle what? her, kill her man for a chuckle, even butcher a cow. But a dog, a kick in passing, no more. So these stray mutts. Fall. Okay, hang on. I don't know if I have the right one. Tracked. Packs. They're gaunt, guts stuck to their spines, covered in scabies, but they just won't die, because they're clever, more so than foxes, and they hate men's... What? Too late. Attacked another one. Too late? What do you mean? What? Do I need to run faster on my horse or something? Oh my goodness. Did I have saved them? I'm assuming yes. Okay. Well, we did it. Dieter. You know him? We served at the Lord's Manor together, where the Black Army's in camp now. He was a stable hand, I was the Lord's Hunter. But that was before... Well, a long time ago. Before... Before what? Before they drove me from the village. What did you do? Nothing. I'm a freak. What does that mean? Sorry. I'd rather not talk about it. Okay, well now I'm curious. Come on, can we relate? I mean, we get called names. I'm a freak too. <laughs> Aye, but of another kind. If it's lycanthropy, I can help. Oh. What? Lycanthropy. Werewolves? Werewolves. Handled a few cases in the past. It's usually a simple curse The that... Lord's son, Florian, and I... We loved each other. Dieter walked in on us in the stables. Oh. They drove me away. Florian hanged himself. Lord started drinking, and the estate fell into ruin. 
that's the long and short of it. Oh. I'm sorry. Poor guy. Uh, ancient history now. Not a werewolf. I was to show you no. where I found the Nilf Guardians. Come. Griffin, know anything about it? Not much. It's not my kind of game. You're his. Okay, wait, before he keeps talking. Okay, so when you've gained a certain number, yeah, you get a level. Cool. Ability points. Got it. An ability's color indicate indicates which branch it belongs to. Yep, okay. And then we develop the ability. So... So, vitality. Oh, I select it with that. Okay, and then we acquire it. Right? Yes. You must first activate it by placing it in any open ability slot. Inactive abilities will not have any effect. Okay. Huh. Okay, and you can swap them out. Cool. Though, Perfect. Survival instincts alone ought to make you care. I walk silent through the woods. No griffin can hear me nor spy me. We're, we're starting to learn the rules of the world. And Twas here. How? One lay there, by the stump. People headless. are here. The other hung from a branch. Guts splayed, stretching down to... Watch out for yourself now. Um... I'll be fine. Not the first griffin I've dealt with. Not likely to be the last, either. Hope you're right. Good hunting now. Hmm. Elf Guardians were celebrating. Griffin interrupted them. So it doesn't really seem Ground's like black, saturated with blood. He likes the Nilf Guardians all that much, just from a lot of these dialogue options. A camp. Huh. These prints are older and deeper, heavily armored. Nilf Guardians, probably. Let's go run and jump across. Oops, that's the wrong button, but that's okay. We still need it. Griffin's nest. What remains of it at least? Hmm. Corpse is a couple of weeks old. What? Still alive when the Griffin brought him here. Took a long time dying. Figuring out how to climb the ledges, thank you. So, is, is the griffin Female. Dead? Larvae and her wounds have already hatched. Been dead at least a week. Other griffin must be a male. Huh. Is it getting revenge? Deep it cuts over the whole what? body. Not a drop of blood on the beak or claws. Yeah. Didn't defend herself. Killed. Crept up on her while she slept. Beak tips worn, gray hairs in the coat. Ten, twelve years old. Griffins pair off for life when young. Male must be about the same age. Hmm. They pair off for life. Oh, this is gonna be tragic. Okay, this is gonna be tragic, and we're gonna need to go get revenge. Well, well, no, it's getting revenge, and now we gotta go kill it? Like, oh, that's just tragic. Thick shaft. Dense barbs. A royal griffin. Explains why the male I ran into was so aggressive. Hunted the Nilf Guardians down here in the forest first, then started prowling the area. Huh. 
Oh dear, preparing for combat. Never underestimate your opponent. This rule is at the core of the Witcher's Code, and for good reason. Proper preparation has saved many a Witcher's life. It is like likewise worth your while to brew potions, concoct oils, or visit craftsmen before engaging in combat. Blacksmiths forge weapons, while armors craft armor. If you expect to battle a strong opponent, you might want to complete some side quests before attacking. This will allow you to gain experience and develop your character, giving you a better chance of winning the fight. Oh, so they're saying before you go fight the griffin, be prepared. That's going to be our, our first boss fight. Sounds like. What is this? Let's, let's see what this is. We gotta start learning about the lore here. Emir Var Emery's rules to expand. He has trained his strategic brilliance on a singular vision, to conquer the world, though he rightly calls this not conquest, but salvation. Yes, the Emperor of Nilfgaard sets the world alight with the torch of civilization. Hmm. Hmm. Trampling the still warm corpses of his father's usurpers, the Emperor seized the throne and began to assimilate the northern realms one after another. Terror engulfed the north. Only the Battle of Brenna slowed the Imperial Army's march toward victory. A temporary peace then took hold, though none believed this mirage would last. Amir's aim to make the entire north a vassal of Nilfgaard remained unchanged. Amir used peace as a cover to intensify his political efforts. Now all can see the results. Chaos and disorder devour the Nordling states. Ridden with internal bickering and backstabbing, they near collapse. Only a strong ruler can grapple this dysfunction into function. Only a wise ruler can give vision to their blindness. Only a mere of our Emery's can save the North. So our armies have again crossed the ya Yaruga for the third and final time. So I'm not loving how they're presenting themselves here, if if I'm honest. N minus points for Nilfgaard. I'm excited to check out like all the crafting. I'm just gonna grab all this stuff. Sorry. Hope you didn't need your garden. I did. <laughs> Bad time. Not at all. Hand me the beggar tickets that... Red Bloom, well, well, one versed in herbs. Probably saying too much, but I know a bit. For instance, that beggar ticks poisonous. In large doses, small ones soothe pain and bring forth pleasant dreams. Huh. Which is all I can hope to do for her. Griffin, or... Griffin do that to her? To Lena. Yes. Attacked her at night. She was walking in the woods. At night? Through the woods? In wartime? Meeting a boy. To the young, you know, do foolish things for love. Wounds are healing, but she will die. Blood's pooling in her skull. Nothing my bruise can do to help. Here's the thing. I'm no longer, like, really in, like, a hurry to kill the Griffin. Because, like, the Griffin, it sounds like, is just, like, avenging... It's... It's Griffin wife that was slain in the night. Like, I... Poor thing. But, like, it's murdering people now. Like, a lot of people. So, that's... It is kind of a problem. But, like... Hmm. Could try to help her with one of my potions. Swallow can heal internal hemorrhages. But? Witcher's potions aren't for humans. She'll die as it is. Yes. A peaceful death soothed by your concoctions. Oh. If I give her swallow and something goes wrong, the whole village will hear her screams. Oh. I understand. Oh. Wait. Do as you will. Wait. Are we... Did we offer to kill? Hmm. Helping. Looking for Buckthorn. Know if it grows anywhere around here? Hmm. Bottom of the river, where the channel's widest. But you do know that once out of the water... It'll stink worse than a weak old carcass. Counting on it. I'm hunting the griffin. Need the buckthorn for bait. I was thinking... A few years ago, we had trouble. Drowners under the bridge. Whole village had to pitch in for a witcher. 
Who now can afford the bounty on a griffin's head? Captain Peter Sars something something. Ah, oh, good to know the Black One's looking out for our welfare. Well, he does. I don't know if she's really gonna care. <laughs> um, like that very much sounds sarcastic. Uh, I don't think in general the Nilfgaardian seem to care very much, but like this guy seemed nice enough. But I don't know. Yeah, like they're trying to just not have everyone die. Like that's helpful, I suppose. Nilfgaard values one thing, order. Griffin's disturbing that. It's gotta go. Yes. First they'll tend to the monsters, then to the folk. <laughs> not from here, are you? A lot of bitterness in you. Too much for someone who spent her life in a hut in the middle of nowhere. True. <laughs> and you're in a hurry. Elsewise you'd not use bait, just wait for the griffin to attack again. Believe we could have an interesting conversation. Maybe next time. Maybe next time. So that means maybe come back here? Huh. Okay. Like, does she... What does she have? Yes. What's, what's her deal? Tell me something about yourself. What's your story? A sad one. Do you know the Temple of Melitale in Alanda? Do I know it? Can't remember how many times I've been there, how many times Mother Nenica stitched me up. We must have missed each other. I started to become a healer under Mother Nenica. Hmm. I was but 18 when they took me in. An age at which teachings interest one far less than love. There was a boy, Goslath. He'd bare his chest to work. The novices couldn't keep their eyes off him, tripped over their own feet, dropped things. I left the temple for him. <laughs> we passed a lovely summer together, and then he left. Neneke refused to take me back. My parents uttered not a word, gave me a travel cloak and a small coin pouch. I struggled long to find a place where I'd feel safe, needed, Oof. until I finally arrived here. End of story. Makes sense why she's very sympathetic to the girl who snuck out. Farewell. <laughs> very well written. That's it, Roach. Let's go. Faster. So, where am I going? By the riverbed. We're basically here. Cool. Whoa there, Roach. You hang out, Roach. Go eat some grass. Am I supposed to, like... Okay, no. On the riverbed? Am I supposed to go swimming? It's showing me, like, in the water. Oh, yeah, no, wait, it's, like, down there. Oh, no, we're going, we're going diving. Oh, oh, I did not realize there was, like, a whole swimming diving thing. What? Okay, did not know that. Don't want to run out of breath. We got plenty, right? What else is down here, though? Looks like there's something. Okay, okay, we gotta go up. Up. Quickly now. Should talk to Vesemir. There's like more treasure down here? Ooh. So, it's useful. 
Let's get out of the water. So, am I supposed to go here in town? I'm assuming yes. Yeah, cool. Let's go. Only the stamped ones Woodman. get the quest. Whose field okay, that is that sense. the Thank other you. side of the river? By the wood or in clinics. Good lad, Master Witcher. Though he... Yes, yes, this boy in. Will he venture out to inspect his grain anytime soon? Yes. What is it, Wolf? Um... Realize it's been half a year since we hunted down that fiend in Varun? Yes. Well, that was more than a fiend. What was that bastard's name? Drugan? May the soil lie light upon him. Things used to be simpler. Monsters were bad, humans good. Now, everything's all confused. Used to be exactly the same. You've just forgotten. Do well not to point up my age. You're near a century old yourself. Oh my. Keep hearing the cat in the background? How cute. Got good news and bad news. Good news first. Captain of the Nilfgaardian garrison knows where Yennefer went. And the bands that we have to kill the Griffin for him. What else could he want from two witchers? Go on. Tell me what you know. Griffin's abandoned its lair. Gotta make a lure, set a trap. And how's that going? Well... Learned some things. It's a male, had its nest in the Vulpine woods. The Nilfgaardians burned the woods down, killed its mate, smashed their eggs. Thought they'd fixed things. <laughs> it's always the same. Instead of sending for a professional, they try to do it themselves, only end up making matters worse. Got the buckthorn. Ought to work like a charm. Powerful scent. More like stench. City boy. Rotting meat, manure, piss, <laughs> standard smells of the countryside. <laughs> Remember Tredegor? Hunting that zoogle in the trash heap? You spent half the next day bathing, scrubbing yourself. How can I forget? You ever gonna stop bringing that up? <laughs> <laughs> Fine. If everything's ready, say the word and we'll get to work. Okay. Um. So. Later, Vesemir. I think this is what it's saying. Okay. So this is telling me, from what I understand right now, that we are ready to hunt the thing. If there are any of these other side quests we want to do, it looks like we need to go do them. So like this. Where is this? Yeah, this is in the town. So let me go back over here and do like another thing or two before we go fight them. Have on my gut. I am running into things. We are learning. Learning how the running works. <laughs> Hello. Greetings, good man. Having trouble with your well? That's what I read. Aye. Tis haunted. Haunted? Has been for a good twenty years. Twenty? So why do you put out a notice just now? Because earlier on we drew our water from the river. But so many corpses floating in it after the battle is turned noxious. My daughter Mandy drank half a pitcher. Felt dreadful ill. Can't keep nothing down. She grows worse by the day. Herbalist claims you fight a fever with drink. And not beer nor cider, but water. Clear, pure water. And where am I to get that if not from the well? But first, the ghost's got to be driven away. And it don't let any man near. Yeah, no beer when you're gonna have a fever. It's gonna need to be some water. I'll help. This ghost. Describe it for me. Well... It's awful frightening. Awful. I meant, what does it look like? It looks like a woman, but fresh from the grave. Wears a dirty dress, all rags, its skin flaking off its bones, and it howls like it's suffering. Some wraith. 
Or maybe an alp. If you don't wallop it, master. If you don't take care of it, that is. It'll come kill me daughter. Um... My reward? That... that is... What witchers do. It looks like we don't have to do that, though, so that's kind of interesting. Um, I mean, he did put out, like, a thing, though, so there is a reward. Let me, let me ask. I gotta see what the vibe is with, with this situation. I feel for you, but this is my job, so let's talk about my pay. Something not right with the coin. Oh. Interesting. So you can haggle? Annoyance level? Oh, I didn't really feel like I needed to, to negotiate with this guy, but can I get big money, an extra two? That settles it then. Okay. Woo! I got two extra monies. What are, what are the monies called? What are they called here? I, I don't know if they've told me yet. Um, <laughs> it's good. Woohoo! Fine, I'll help. Where's this well? In Havel. A settlement on the heights. It's abandoned now. No one ventures there on account of the ghost being about. Drive it off. Please. Okay, everyone just avoids it because it's haunted. Well, sounds like a job for us. Well, well, well. Okay. <clears throat> anyway. If you, like, ran into them, they would just, like, jump out of the way. They'd be like, ah! The infamous well. Okay, it's been just a moment since I saved. Strange. So no sign of a good... We're gonna save. Ghost. Maybe it only shows at a certain time of day. Okay. So a certain time of day. Of course, it's, like, in the morning. So, of course, we're gonna need to wait all day. That is... That is classic. Grass around the well scorched. Gonna check it out first, though. Grass around the well scorched. Yeah, we saw that. Let me just check out. Bodies dried to a crisp. Other things. Signs of burns. All signs point to a noon wraith. There's different money depending on the region. What am I hearing? Can I hit my way through here? Oh, I can. Oh, nice. I was like, that looks like something I can break. And then it... I love that. I love when that kind of stuff actually works. Oh, I'm just... I'm causing chaos. Get me out of here. Enough chaos has been caused. We should probably just meditate and wait until the evening. Like, technically, we could just go do other side quests first and come back, but we might as well just meditate, right? Anything in here? Not looking like a lot to find. Black magic doll and a yellow Journal. diary. Might be useful. Uh, 27. Is that like supposed to be like the third month or something? 1250. It's happened. Volker sent a petition of our grievances against the Lord to court at Vizima. Listed all the harm he's done us. How he killed Johan for not taking off his cap quick enough. How he trampled our fields when drunk with nary a thought of repayment. How he barged in during Peter's wedding and demanded his right of the first night. Now we finally got what we begged Mithiel for in our prayers for so long. The judge recognized our grievances and waived all our bonds and duties to the Lord. We can finally strike out on our own. The first day of our freedom. 
Hovel's not much of a village yet, but to my mind, it's better than the most fantastic palace. Volker fumed our home with hazelwood smoke to drive out evil, buried a Martin under the gate to make sure no thieves cross our threshold. And then he gave me a bracelet, loveliest I've ever seen. Mother says it's foolish to spend so much on a bauble when we haven't plows nor hose that we ought to return it to the merchant. Over my dead body, I'll never take it off. It'll always be there to remind me of Volker, of how happy we were that day. They say the Lord is coming to see us, that he wants to make a deal, to beg us to return to the village. They say he's calmed since his son died, that he's not as quick to anger about small slights. Well, we'll see. One way or another, I've no intention to move one inch from here. Huh. What happened here? We go back out here and... Can I, like, do anything here? No? Let me wait. It's like a long time. Oh? Nope. Okay. Strange. Doing She's great. not attacking. She's not attacking. Oh, got too close. Read the entry in the bestiary, it says. Okay. Despite what is commonly thought, peasants do not interrupt their labors at midday to get out of the sun. They do so to avoid noon wraiths. On particularly searing summer days, when the sun reaches its zenith, wraiths will at times appear, resembling sun-scorched women dressed in long white robes. These are noon wraiths, the spirits of young women and girls who died violent deaths right before their weddings. Driven mad with pain or anger, they wander the field searching for their unfaithful lovers or backstabbing rivals. Though they will kill anyone who does not get out of their way in time. They are often held in this world by some object of intense emotional significance. If one ever finds a wedding ring or a torn veil in the middle of a field, one should not pick it up, but instead back away as quickly as possible. Okay, so it looks like there's a sign that there. Something's tied the noon wraith to this place. An object. Something she needs before she leaves this world. Okay, so I gotta find what binds her here. Okay, so we read the thing. We read the thing. Hang on. We read the thing. It gave us a clue. Where's... So, let me read this again. It's a necklace? A bracelet. So we gotta find the bracelet. Where's the bracelet gonna be? It's gotta be in one of these houses, right? To deal with this. Did I already investigate that? Hang on. What about oh, those are bones. A man stabbed with a knife, died on the spot. Animals fed on his body, picked his skeleton clean. More blood stains over there. But it's not his blood. A man stabbed with yep, a knife, no, I, died I on the spot. It. Blood Animals stains fed on his body, barely visible. The skeleton clean. Someone was dragged this way. Someone who was still alive. Palm prints in blood. Small hands. A woman's. Someone dragged her out. She was wounded. Fought for her life. No body in sight, but might still find some tracks. Under the right conditions, blood stains can remain visible for decades. Another print by the well. Huh. No, it's like showing me over here now. There it goes. Okay. Blood stains. Almost faded. But the line's taut. Something's not right. A corpse. 
hanged by the bucket rope. Woman the journal belonged to have a bracelet. must be. Wide pelvis, small jaw. A woman. Around 30, judging by the teeth. Left arms missing. Need to cremate the remains. Gotta find the object that binds her to this place before I do, though. Was she wearing the bracelet from her husband? Oh. Might be why her arm fell off. Gotta jump down there. Oh. Hope I don't break my legs. Yeah, maybe don't drink that water anymore. That's a fair point. Um... Uh... Can I- can I shield myself? Look at me go. Oh, wait. It doesn't matter. There's water. Anything's fine? Yeah, come on. Okay, wait. What are- which direction are we going? that must have belonged to the woman in the well. Lovely craftsmanship, but I'll have to burn it with the body to get rid of the noon wraith for good. Better do it near the well. Okay. Let's just go. See how this goes. this goes and the bracelet hopefully Igni. well just gotta remember to actually use some powers So does she have to be like in that? Too bad. Good. You found a mutagen. Use How are you still alive? <laughs> Use it to enhance your abilities or create a special potion called a mutagen decoction. Okay. Uh. What is that? Plus 50 vitality. Okay. Sure. They're marked with a color. Put a mutagen in a field with at least one ability of the same color to increase its bonus. If an ability does not match the color of the mutagen in its field, it does not increase the mutagen's bonus. Oh, so there's colors and stuff to this. The more abilities in a field that match the color of that field's mutagen, the greater the mutagen's bonus. And then also there's the potions. Got it. Huh, okay. Where's the ingredients? Here's some. We could do 
some fast traveling. It's honestly, it's not that far. We're just gonna wait. Job done. The well was haunted by the ghost of a woman who was killed there. I drove it away. I just hope every unburied wretch don't start haunting us. Well, that battlefield's gonna cause us a heap of trouble. If they do, you know who to contact. Meanwhile, Claire, Volker, names ring a bell? I don't know him. Though I did hear our herbalist Tamira mention a Claire once. Same one, maybe? Your reward, Master Witcher. The gold I'd hid away for Mandy's dowry. Without you, she'd never have lived to wed. Now, there's hope for it, at least. I feel like I should not take that. We don't really need the coin that bad. At this point, doubt I'll ever marry. You keep the coin from Mandy, her wedding. Raise a toast to my health then. Thank you, Aww. Master Witcher. Them's warm words. You've a good heart. But I can't let you go empty handed. Take this at least. Good luck. What to give us? An amethyst. Okay. I mean, he does know how to make a witch happy, I suppose. Give a crystal. <laughs> make it pretty. <laughs> I'll loot his stuff too. Should I, should I loot this stuff? Yeah, I'm gonna. Thank you. Goodbye. Okay, what else were we doing? So we're preparing to fight the griffin. What other quests did we have in the area? Where's of his peasant who was seeking a... Okay. Someone wanted to find their brother. Oh, I didn't end up taking the potion to the lady. Uh, we can go do that. We'll do that soon. But yeah, let's... Let's do this. So where in the world is that? That's over here. So we can just kind of swoop. Oh, we gotta we gotta go from the signpost. Yeah, it was that one group of people that I didn't talk to? Oops. Later, once it's safe. Uh. What happened here? Do that often? Talk to your dog? It's my brother's, Bastion's. But I guess he's mine now. Looks like See, gun and Bastion fought dog. the black ones in a battle just outside the village. I haven't had word of him since. I told him, do like I did. Lose a finger or two so they won't recruit you. It... Too damn afeard he was. Bloody hell. Um... Okay, I, I, <laughs> interesting. I'll help. I'd walk the battlefield if I were you. I did. Sea of corpses and corpses feeding. Someone told me they're afraid of fire, so I took a torch, tried to chase them off. Horse shite, I tell you. Would have ended up eaten alive if it weren't for Hussar here. Listen. Guessing you carry those swords for more than show. Come with me. Keep the ghouls off. Help me find Bastion and I'll pay you well. Fine. I'll help you. Just... Been a few days since the battle. Chances we find your brother alive are slim. Very slim. Who would have thought? But I want to find his body at least. So Bastion don't rot there in the sun with the black ones. Yeah. Meet me on the hill overlooking the battlefield. We'll move on together from there. Okay. People have been having a rough one here. Goodness. Move it. Let's take a look around here. So many corpses. And the war's just started. Yeah, wow. Quite a quite a war. Pretty sky, look at that. Very nice. Unfortunate it has to be such a gruesome place. You're here, good. Bastion. His body must be here somewhere. Among countless others. Want to examine them one by one? Could take a while. You needn't fret. 
the recruits from White Orchard painted a small flower on their shields so as to be able to spot each other in battle. There was just a few of them. We look for the flowers, we'll find Bastion quick. No offense, but hmm. many a soldier's dropped his shield, especially if he was on the losing side. If we find the shield alone, Hassan will catch the scent and lead us to Bastion. Come on. Sooner we get this done, the better. Okay. Go to the marked area. Yep. Here we go. Looking for shields. Definitely gonna need to fight these things. So, yep. Oh, let's get a sword. Can we get a sword, please? Time to chat. Let's do nope. what we've come to. Good time to lose. Okay, where'd he go? He's gone. Here he is. That him? No. Neighbor's son. Son. Again? Come on, Hassar! Can you smell Bastion, boy? Uh, still nothing. Uh, skin's burned off. Come on, Hassar! Might be Can hard to Bastion, tell, boy? I know, but could this be him? Uh, still nothing. He found him! Hassar's mm -hmm. caught, he's sent! Come on! But there is more. My lieutenant demanded we defecate on command. Ballista bolts landing all around, and all he could say was, A soldier with a full stomach will not step onto the battlefield. Now shit, that is an order. Can you believe it? The cretin. Stop! Oh, you're, oh, you're killing me. My, my ribs. Oh, it hurts to laugh. That needs a tourniquet. But first... Want to explain what's going on here? Bastion! Is he... Has this Nilf Guardian captured you? No! <laughs> he saved my life. I, I got a cut to me side. And then got hit in the head. Couldn't see anything. Rosin here found oh. me as... As he crawled across the battlefield. His legs twisted. And so we were. A blind man leading a cripple. Found this place. I'm taking you home. We need to see to these wounds. I won't leave Rose in here. I'll own he'll die. And he can't go back to his home. He's deserted. They'll hang him. And what if they find him with us? They'll hang us all, my Laisha included. No, the blackened stays here. Okay, so they hit me with the dilemma. Um, so it is risky. Well, it sounds like they're kind of buddies. But like, I get that like he's trying to watch out for like the family, but like, uh, I don't know if we should kill the guy, but I also don't know like, like, I don't know. He would be dead. Bastion only made it with the Black One's help. 
Maybe you ought to show him Nordlings aren't as barbarous as Nilfgaardians make us out to be. Well, Fair. I could give him our pa's clothes, teach him to work the field, but that accent... Fine, I'll take him in. Thank you, Witcher. Your reward. And the gods protect you. I hope that works out for them. I really hope. I really, really hope. Okay, so there was like one more quest that we had. We needed to finish this one up. Take the potion to the earth quest. Where is that? We are way over here. So let's. Hello. Yes. So. We can give her a potion. Got a potion for Lena. Swallow. Yeah. Bear sign of spring. That's what we need. Symbol of rebirth. Fitting as names go. We'll see. Like I said, could harm her deeply. Works on me immediately, but I have a faster metabolism. Effects won't appear in her case for a few days. Why'd you choose this in the end? Decided it was better than doing nothing. I like you, Witcher. Here. A small gift. For giving a damn. What did she give us? And we leveled. Probably this one? Don't know. Yes? Listen, ever heard of a woman named Claire? Lived around here? Heard of her? A mild way to put it. Claire was a friend. The only person dear to me in all of White Orchard. Until her husband, Volker, quarreled with the Lord of the Manor. He then gathered the family, moved out into the woods to start a new settlement. The Lord and his retinue rode there to convince them to return. They were to be civil. No forcing, no bloodshed. But, you saw. Word is Claire said something about the Lord's son, Florian. Something that made the Lord furious. But who knows the truth? Lots of misfortune for such a small village. It is so in every village. Even the smallest. You need only ask. But let's not end on a teary note. Here, a bit of solace. Huh. Huh. So she gave us some experience for talking about that. A little money. Interesting. So, if we go back on the world map. So our quests. We need to go back and talk to Vesemir. But before we do that. We're gonna go. To the inn. So, these guys. Hello. What a waste of time. The Earth shall revolve around the sun before you comprehend these rules. Got a minute? Why not? Aldert Git, Assistant Professor in Contemporary History at Oxenfurt Academy. Geralt of Rivia. Witcher, with tenure. <laughs> I'm looking for a woman. Long hair, dressed in black and white. Seen anyone like that? Of course not! Unlike the populace, I know the horsewoman of war is what? pure poppycock. The who? Horsewoman of war? What's that about? Folks say an omen. A beautiful phantom rides the fields at night, looks as you described her, armies follow her, and all who cross her path meet with misfortune. I can vouch for the last bit. Know where they saw her? No, facts interest me, not fairy tales. Not a place I'd ever expect to find a scholar. Take it you're fleeing the war? Quite the opposite. Chasing it. I'm headed for the front. Tired of life? I seek knowledge, which I value more than life itself. 
I've a thirst no dusty old tomes can quench. I wish to see the Nilfgaardian invasion with my own eyes, understand it, and record it all in my chronicle, my magnum opus. Um... Okay. Interesting. We need somebody to describe war, what it's really like. Uh, not colorful okay, banners no, and generals maybe making not, moving speeches, but not late the, violence no, and thoughtless cruelty. No, ah, I see you lack the no, polish of the academy. Not quite. Rape and cruelty no, yeah. are details of no import to the war's course. Okay. Trinkets no on the garment import? of conflict, one might say. <laughs> Tell that to the people whose houses burned down. Trinkets on the garment of conflict. Hmm. Okay. Well, um, maybe this guy's not the. Hmm. I have, I have many thoughts. <laughs> War reached Novigrad yet? Nope. But it's only a matter of time. Nilfgaard on one bank, Redania on the other, drooling over the city like dogs over a juicy bone. Many a ruler's choked on that bone. True. We value our liberty in Novigrad, and we know how to fight for it. Mm -hmm. The scholars especially. The sword is not the only weapon. Do not forget, architects from our academy designed the city walls. Walls no war machine has ever crumbled. Gotta go. So long. A moment, Witcher. You strike me as a man of the world. Are you familiar with Gwent? No, and I don't have time to learn. But the rules are quite simple. Come, let's play. Okay. Hmm. Why not? Splendid! Here's how it's done. Yes, tutorial. I know nothing about this. Okay, it's an ancient dwarven card game that simulates the clash of two armies in battle. The players are generals and the cards are their forces. Is this similar or comparable to any other game out there? I think I just need to learn this. Okay. To begin, you draw 10 cards. This will be your hand for the rest of the match. You will not draw any more cards. Cool. Choose a card to redraw. Adds plus one to all units. Okay, yeah. So, this is a unit card. The strength. Okay. Yeah. The number in the upper left-hand corner indicates its strength. When placed on the battlefield, this value is added to the total strength of the player who placed it. A combat row icon. Okay, so close ranged or siege. Some have special abilities. This one's special ability is called the morale boost, which grants plus one strength to all units in the same row. Got it. Weather cards are a special type, are a type of special card. They reduce the strength of all cards of a given type on the battlefield, including your own. At the start of each game, you can select up to two cards to discard and redraw. Okay, we're gonna skip that, we're just getting straight to playing. Okay. Here's the battlefield, this is your side, this is your opponent's. During each turn, a player may place one card on the battlefield or pass. Each deck has a leader. The leader grants you a special ability, which can only be used once during a battle. Trigger the special ability at any point by pressing X. Okay. Select a card, place it. Uh, I don't know, this guy, you go crazy. Okay, the play player with the highest total strength wins at the end of a turn, okay. So you can pass. You should pass when you are confident you can win with the units you already have in play, or let your opponent win and save your cards for the next round. A round ends once both players have passed. The players then compare the total strength of their units. So... You just put down all the cards, right? Try to figure out, like, what the strategy is here. I don't really understand yet. Like, just put this guy down, I guess? It's my first game ever. Yeah, no, I have no idea what I'm doing. Literally none. Uh... 
So, yeah, so it's about strategically placing them in order to have enough to win multiple rounds. Okay, so you want to start smaller if you can, it looks like. Okay, so I'm going to lose that turn or something? Don't know. So he's putting down like more? Like torrential rain? I see, so I can like use that to bring his strength down. thing. Um, I should not do that. I don't know. This can go down next, I suppose. So did he just do something to take away the effect that I'd given? That's what it looks like. was clear weather. Okay, so... What I have right now is not very good. Alright. put that there. Do I use the leader card? Okay, so that was a round. Uh, yeah, no, this is my first everything. I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, I think I still did it though, right? Yeah, no, I still won. Uh, it's good. <laughs> oh, I needed the cards for the next round? Oh, okay. Oh, that's what you guys were trying to say. I, okay, got it. Well, here we go. Big trebuchet. Big damage. Rude. Rude. Yeah, that's okay. At least it was quick. Yeah, okay. At least it was quick. Okay. So, well... Hmm. Rude. It's not a game for everyone. Requires an analytical yeah, mind. Whatever. Mm -hmm. If you ever find yourself in Oxenfurt and wish to play oh, a no. true master, ask for Stepan. A simple innkeep by trade, but a true master. Doesn't even let me go again. I'll remember that. Thanks. Yeah, learning new games, card games especially, always so simple. It's like when someone sits there and explaining the directions and then just like your brain just kind of just 
you just are like, huh? What did, I next understood nothing. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, time to fight the boss. I think it is, right? Can we get some hype? I think it's time to, uh... Yes? What is it, Wolf? Let's go do this. Been busy with the Griffin contract. And? I'm ready. No point in waiting. Let's find a good spot to ambush it. Picked one out already. Other side of the stream. There's fields and a grove. Plenty of room and far enough so no one will get in our way. Good. Meet you there. Like this is the field. Hey there. Quick save. A stream, amber waves of grain. Charming place. Perfect for an ambush. I know how to choose them. So, ready? Let's go. Let's start. Wind's good. Bait's scent will spread quickly. Now all we have to do is wait. Come on, we can cower in the shade of those birches. So tell me, once we find Yennefer, what'll you do? Got your eye on a contract? No, I'll go to Kaer Morhen. Little early to settle in for the winter. Snows are a way off, yes. And that's what worries me. Nilfgaard's crossed the Pontar in the east. Puts them... Maybe a week's march from Kaer Morhen. If they reach the valley before snows can cover the passes... Well, we need to cover our tracks, hide our paths. Speaking of winter and wintering, think you'll come this year? Maybe. Might bring a guest. <laughs> okay. It's close. Let's go give it a warm welcome. Wait, make this. A crossbow. Won it in a card game while you ran around. Might gonna come wonder in handy. when we were gonna get a crossbow. Okay. Gambling, huh? How about that? Always lectured us on the evils, <laughs> but you're a gambler yourself. Stop talking. Got a griffin to kill. He doesn't want to hear it. <laughs> Watch out! All right. I don't think Roach wants anything to do with this. <laughs> I think Roach is like, nope. Oh, 
There we go. I was not using enough of my magic, I realized. Okay, uh, enter the meditation panel. If you have hard alcohol in your inventory, it will automatically be used to create a new batch of every alchemy item you have. That's cool. Oh. Yeah, we, we, we live, it's fine. <laughs> not bad, not bad. Though you could stand yeah, to improve some things. Yeah, he's not wrong. Man spends his whole life learning. Not a witcher, unless he doesn't want to live long. <laughs> but more on that later. Take the griffin's head to the black ones. I'll ready our horses. Meet me at the inn. Okay. Can I loot? Take the trophy. Yep, come on. How do I do this? Do I... How do I do this? Oh, it, it brought up loot for a second. It brought it up for half a second. There we go. And yes, my new identity as Paige the Witcher is born, right? <laughs> Thanks, Divichi. Thank you for the hype. Seriously, thank you. This is gonna be a fun, fun journey. Come on. All right, let's go back there. And see what we can learn about Yennefer. Oof, freak. Oops, sorry. I did run you over. I, I get that you're upset. Okay, where am I supposed to go here? World map. Yeah, we can go across here first. Okay, okay. Let me turn this in. What the hell is this? Roy! You take me for a blind what? man or a fool? This grain is rotten. Uh... I, I didn't know. So, a fool. Damn it, you never learn. This is the Military guy. Codex, Article 2, Section 3. For the delivery of defective goods, 15 lashes with a knout. Make it so. No, no, no! By the gods, no! Oh. Oh. What happened there? What? You know, uh, a little bit of a, a different, different tone. Guess you've dropped your good uncle act. It was no act. I extended a hand to these people. They spat on it. Could it be because it held the sword that killed their loved ones? Tcha! A moralist. And what would you do in my stead? Wouldn't ever be in your stead. Tell me why you've come. Fulfilled my end of the bargain. Your turn. Where'd Yennefer go? To Vizima. She was a day's ride from here the whole time? Under my nose? Might have said so. Yes, I might have. But you would not have killed the griffin. Tit for tat. Halt! We are not done. It's yours, this gold. I would not want you to say you were inadequately compensated. Huh. Oh, so this is going to be a timed dialogue. We just take it? I mean, sure. Let's keep it a fair deal. I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't have, but... We did, we did what was agreed upon, right? No more. Please, no more. Okay, so... Mercy! <laughs> this is looking climbable. Ah, ah, ah! I've done it. Time to end this. Uh, 
Bye bye head. Oh. Oh. Uh. Well. Angrily scrawled notes. What am I supposed to die for? To marry it? Da died for that. So did my three brothers. And what'd that get them? Not even a decent burial. Uh, I'm learning from his mistakes. Instead of dying for Tamaria, I'm gonna rob those who killed Tamaria's sons. We pitched a camp, got us a great spot, middle of the woods, near that old mill. Now we're all set up to go on our first raid. Oof. Oof. The witcher Colgrim stands accused of kidnapping Vidi, son of Paul, a beekeeper residing in the White Orchard. We read about this. Suspect was detained pending trial. Upon detention, he was searched and a diagram for the forging of a steel sword was found on his person. It is suspected this sword was used to intimidate or possibly kill the kidnapped child. It is likewise suspected that the accused possesses su other such diagrams for the forging of death-dealing implements, though none have been found to date. Sir Ignatius has requested the Witcher undergo preliminary interrogation with the application of torture. This will take place once a torturer with the proper qualifications has been found. It was later discovered drowners were responsible for the boy's disappearance. Unfortunately, Colgrim died before this information reached the investigators, for rather than face the baronet's judgment, he chose trial by ordeal. Sir Ignatius agreed and ordered he cleanse the fairy's family crypt of specters. Colgrim never emerged from said crypt. Yeah, no, we, uh, we did find him. We did find him there. He did not emerge. Hey, we completed the scavenger hunt! Look at that! Wow, we found something we were looking for here. Okay, anything else in this area? Then let's let's wrap some things on up here. Um, you know what's that way? Directly behind us. Here's what we're looking for. Blowing what is this? Dope, Can't quick save. Already in combat. Okay. Shut up and fight. There we go. Okay. Some loot, please. What was this? Oh, that's fire. Velen Longsword. So is this mainly how I get like good new like weapons and stuff? Is just kind of searching around for stuff like this? That's kind of what it seems. Alright, one last thing here. Let's go over this way. And see what there was over here. We'll be nicely prepared for tomorrow, and hopefully we can actually find Yennefer in a timely manner. <laughs> Maybe. Ooh. Oh yeah, there's just a bunch of things like under underwater. Those are the ones that I think explode. Huh. Smuggler's cash. Oh. Okay, hang on. Let's go around the other side. I think I just need to bring us back to a sign. So let's go this way and we're just gonna go towards this abandoned village. Oops, that's not what I meant to press, but that's fine. Hey ya. Right, he was jumping as high as the ledge and couldn't grab it. I love it. Um, that's not the right way. We are not going towards the quest marker. <laughs> yeah, you can't kill the Skyrim bunnies, not with those 8k textures. 
true. Faster. I like how the horse stopped for a bunny right there. That's good. Gotta respect the textures. Pretty bunnies. Wait, what is that? What is that? Be gone, ghouls. Can you please use? Oh, I wasn't using the right one. Fence is not not my friend. Not friends with the fence right now. Can I just <laughs> be here a while? What have I done? What's happening? Huh? Did I help? Oh, I helped. Look at me. Area liberated. Its populace has returned. Oh. Cool. Gods preserve ye. Herbalist. What? Hello. What you got? Got anything interesting? Okay. Farewell. Okay, are we almost to our sign? Yeah, we're almost back at the sign. What is this one last thing over here? I gotta go check out one last go, thing. Go. Like, actually, one last thing. For real this time. Mm, magic. A place of power. Oh, a bear? It's sleeping. I don't know if I should attack the sleeping bear. It looks like I have to. Okay, I have to in order to get the thing. else around here? Nope. Alright, back to our side. Let me mark it. Okay, so we're gonna be a lot stronger now because we actually just went and oopsies did all of that stuff. Yeah, we got most everything over here. Awesome. Okay, now I'm actually going to call it here, so that we are nicely prepared for tomorrow. I think we did pretty good. We don't level as quickly as I, like, was initially thinking, you know, with, like, Skyrim and stuff. It's at a little bit of a slower pace, but I like it because it's not, like, overwhelming with, like, throwing new abilities and things at you, because there's already a lot to this game. But look at how pretty it is! Like, look at that. Think photo mode? Yeah, that was photo mode. Yeah, it's like cyberpunk. It's like their photo mode. Oh, how cool. Ha ha ha.
Whee! Alright. Save. New save. Game save. And we're out of here. Okay. Wow. What a day. Thank you so much you guys for joining me on this initial bit of this game um i am very intrigued and very happy with the progress that we've made he's sleeping with his mouth open why <laughs> hi dio you look so cute um i'm so happy i'm so happy we have a fun new game like this to get fully immersed in and lost in and uh it's gonna be a busy week, so I'm gonna try to make tomorrow's stream just a little bit longer than today's, but yeah, I'm gonna be online Monday through Friday all week and most of these weeks here, and yeah, it's gonna be a good one. These will be edited and everything up on YouTube um, within a, a couple days here, and I'm just, I don't know, I had a great day, and I hope you guys did too.